Hi, I'm Isaac Mills. In my time here, I've been a member of the Carnegie Mellon track and field team and an ambassador at the Culture Welcome Center. You've just heard about Carnegie Mellon traditions such as booth, buggy, and carnival. I'm here to tell you about one more. Looking right behind me, you can see the fence. Any student is able to paint the fence, but a few rules need to be followed in order to paint it. The first rule is that it can only be painted from midnight to sunrise. The second rule is you can only use 1930s technology to paint the fence. That means paint brushes only. No rollers, spray cans, or any other modern painting technology. The third rule of the fence is that you must paint it in its entirety, from end to end, all over. And the last rule is that in order to keep your message, you must keep two people out there sitting on the gravel all day from your organization. You can rotate within, but as long as you have two, you're able to keep your message. The old fence stood for 65 years and it served as an unofficial billboard to display your message throughout all of campus. Until 1993, it was the most painted object in the world. But over the years, it endured too much paint and it was not able to withstand the weight and collapsed. Now, our new fence is supported by steel and it already has four inches worth of paint caked onto it. Once again, I'm Isaac Mills and this is the tradition of Carnegie Mellon's fence. <laughs>